hi everybody welcome to my youtube channel where we do it ourselves when it comes to doing our hair and today we're going to be reviving our french curl braids i've had it in for about two and a half or three weeks now almost and um i'm still not ready to let this hair go <laughs> like this was uh, this was hard labor doing this hair and i'm i just want to make sure that all the hard work that i put into doing this hair is not gonna go to waste so i'm gonna keep i'm gonna hang on to this hair for as long as i can um but the hair is actually it's not that difficult to maintain you know despite the the texture of of the curls especially the end of the ends of the the braiding it's actually this is some good quality hair and the curls really lasted a long time um where my hair got tangled like this i would just cut out the tangles or i would use um some mousse and a wide tooth comb so i would just apply some mousse to my to to the curls and then i would take a wide tooth comb just to uh, comb out all the knots then i would take my oil sheen spray and just lightly spray the braids just to give it a little bit of a shine and um yeah my braids would look as as good as new i'm not <laughs> i'm I, honestly i'm not lying this hair um i i actually thought i wasn't even gonna keep it in for for more than two weeks because of the texture and i thought that this hair would be all tangled after a week but it didn't you know and when i go to bed at night i don't always put something on my head like i'm i'm lazy and sometimes i'm tired so i just go to bed like that so if I was disciplined and I would put my hair bonnet on every night the hair would actually the hair would be an, in a much better condition or in a much better state than what it is currently but nonetheless that it, it still looks good and I, I didn't want to braid the hair um, too far down because that would have taken forever but then also i love i love the curls and i i really wanted to to leave the curls as is i didn't want to braid the hair too far down now here is something i don't understand this hair is heavy this hair is especially when i'm working out like i when i'm working out i can really feel how heavy this hair is and funny thing is it's it's not even a lot of braiding here i used about two packs of braiding and i didn't even i didn't even finish both packs because there was st still some some braiding hair, hair left and um the braiding wasn't even that long so i i really couldn't understand why these braids were so heavy and this is not even the most amount of braiding that i've had on my head so maybe it's the texture of the braiding I, I i don't know but i couldn't i couldn't tie my hair up in a bun i couldn't do a lot of styling with the braids because i i it was best to just leave the braids loose and just let it hang loose but then i, I have things to do i have chores to do i when i'm at work i don't i i need the braids to be out of my face <laughs> and so yeah the braiding this braiding is beautiful but um maybe i probably should have just used one pack of braiding but then that would not have looked as good as it is now so yeah i don't know <laughs> and the thing is when i'm on pinterest and i see um people with this braiding on they have even more volume on their head and I'm like these people must have strong necks because <laughs> wow <laughs> um you know and in the beginning i just told myself you know what i'm gonna cut the hair a bit shorter after every week but then again i was kind of attached to the length of the hair because i really liked it and i was like i don't want to mess up the curls by cutting the hair shorter and shorter every week 
so i just i i kept the length so what you see me spray here is just some moisturizing hairspray that i'm spraying on my roots especially and to my hairline just to make sure that my hairline is always and i mean always moisturized and then i go in with this oil sheen spray which just basically gives my, my braids a, a, a nice shine to it um, i must say this hair is a lot of maintenance it's not just normal braids where you really don't have to put in a lot of effort but because i didn't braid my hair too far down i i had to make sure that the curls were well maintained and yeah just required a lot of detangling a lot of making sure that the hair still looks shiny but i mean if you don't want to do all that work you can always just braid your hair a bit more further down so the style that i'm doing on these braids is how i would style these braids most of the time because i could not tie the hair up in a bun i just couldn't my neck would hurt after about five minutes honestly <laughs> and i'm not even being dramatic i'm used to having heavy hair on my head um but this was a bit unexpected but nonetheless this is still a cute hairstyle and i honestly i didn't mind um having to do uh, styles like this on my hair only without having you know the option of tying my hair up uh, in a bun or anything like that and i'm actually happy that the size of my braids of my braids are so small because if i made my braids a bit bigger it it surely would have mm, required more braiding hair and it surely would have been a bit more heavier so i'm actually glad that my braids are so so small but i still love 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 these braids and i always say that mini twist braiding is my favorite favorite braiding but these are up there you know french curls are, are up there with mini twists as my favorite kind of braidings so i will definitely be doing this again just in a different hair color or maybe if i can get a different brand of braiding i just honestly i didn't have a lot of options i just had to choose um darling braids but um as soon as i can find a because where i'm currently staying i'm staying in the east of johannesburg and guys in the east rent where do you guys buy braiding hair because while i struggle i can only buy my hair online and um, a lot of these hair salons do not want to sell their braiding hair unless you're going to be doing your hair at their hair salon so <laughs> i really struggle to to find uh, stores where i can buy my braiding hair because when I was in Kimberley, I would just go to a cosmetics connections store. But here in the East Rand, they, there's no beauty supplies, beauty, beauty supply hair stores. So I'm struggling at the moment. But I'm just really grateful for the internet at the moment because I buy my braiding hair online at the moment. Anyway, guys, I hope you enjoy enjoyed this video <laughs> and um yeah i'll speak to you guys next time